my brown and sister all around the world. Those kind of things to you. Welcome to a kind of frappuccino. All right, y'all, let me ask you this, right? What? You're walking one day, you go to your local Starbucks, right? And you bump into a beautiful, 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 beautiful Victoria's Secret female. What? And your blood is like the anime, your heart is pumping, right? And then you just can't stop thinking about her. You gave her her phone number, she gave you your phone number, and cue the Karen. Oh my God! You dated a bodybuilder, somebody with a six pack, you got a one pack, you're slow, you can't do nothing right. I asked you to do something, you do something else. Hold up. Wait a minute, something ain't right. Today we're going to talk about what it's like living with a Karen. What the Before we start the video, hit the subscribe button, hit that notification button, and comment below how long do you live with a Karen, what's your worst experience with a Karen, and did you left her for good and find a better person. And don't forget to follow me on social media, follow me on Twitter at Wakanda Fra and on Instagram at Little Wakanda Guy. Can't go out with her in public. My mom is a bit of a Karen. Wherever we go out to eat, it's always too cold. They don't have the brand of sparkling water she likes. They put ice in her drink when she didn't want it. It gets to the point where if we were out shopping, she said she needs to return something, I just go somewhere else because I couldn't stand watching her being rude and arguing with a staff. Excuse me, excuse me, ma'am. What is this? You just shut up, I'm talking. Do you see what's wrong with it? Cause left eye, why you gave me a full eye? Now you gave me a headache, cause you gave me too much eye. <laughs> Are you trying to make me go to the bathroom for, and sit in the toilet for three hours? You made me feel like a man. What is that smell? You smell like you came from a sewer. Why your hair look like a raccoon? Oh my God, that's your nail? It's just disgusting. <laughs> oh my God, she put nails on my salad. <gasps> Get away from me, Satan. Ooh, the Bible, the Bible. You're gonna get sued, you're gonna lose everything, and I'm gonna be rich. Can't talk to co-worker anymore. My best friend married the Karen. She's the absolute worst. She mean and rude to everyone, even her kid. They discipline when she's around, change completely. A few of us have subtly pointed things out to him, and he always said everyone is overreacting or something to that effect. So one day, over beer, I finally told him how we felt. He begged me to. I lay out clearly why none of his friends would hang out with him anymore. I hate his wife, and I hate Karen. What I thought, I did this, I did this, shut up. What I said about Bobby, do not hang with this man. All of the food is gone, he ate all the dessert. I had to recook it, okay? I had to put bleach all over the food because he left germs in it. This cow, do you see how the cow look like? His butt is, he made a butt mark on his cow. I had to get a new cow, I had to get seven cows that life so okay? He smelled like the point of a bomb that I was going to be extinct, like a dinosaur. What? You are not hanging with him ever again. Shut up, I'm talking. He's not hanging, you hear me? I am putting six locks in this door, you hear me? <laughs> if he ever comes to the door and again, I'm gonna tase him 20 times. I'm gonna watch my love is blind right now. See, the fact just came out of Netflix, so you better tomorrow tell him it's over. It's finished, finito, no, 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 it's done, okay? Blame him. I knew a couple with a Karen. She blamed him for everything. The husband was, in our opinion, something of a saint. Once she broke a glass in the kitchen, came and sat back down at the table and said, that was your fault. Uh -huh. We all just stared at her. She looked sheepish and said, I knew that one probably wouldn't work. They're divorced now. <laughs> Please do not tell me that you broke, that you broke the lamp. <laughs> this is your fault. No, shut up. I can't believe we just bought this. I just bought this like two, two months ago and you broke it. You're paying for that. It's coming out of your wallet. What? I don't care what bank it got from. I don't care if from Wells Fargo, Bank of America. That's great. You're paying for it. This is your fault. Oh. We came late. We were supposed to go to my parents' house 20 minutes ago and we have two hours left. Take a two hour shower, put all spices in, fix your hair, all that get in a car you had to set up the gps to help you navigate uh. you may as late you may as late for church you may as late for the wedding you may as late for the party this is your fault i blame you for the dinner i have food poisoning six times because of you wait a minute my teeth is broken because of you because the mashed potato is so hard <laughs> You burn the kitchen, I had to clean it up, I had to get a new kitchen from Macy, from Gordon Ramsay, stainless steel kitchen. You are not touching the kitchen, you are not doing the dishes ever again, okay? I'm done with you. 
So again, thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed that video. And please guys, comment below on that video guys because I will watch, I will read your comment in the end of the video. So thank you so much. I hope you have a blessed day and don't forget, Wakanda forever.